Alright, uh, today I guess I'll be going over my classes and why I picked the stuff I do since, you know, a lot of people ain't really that good at, you know, Call of, Call of Duty and they could probably use some help and of course they're probably not watching my channel but uh, I'll go over it anyway. Uh, here we got the, my uh, kind of accuracy classes I like to call it. It's a... Uh, uh, Foul with a red dot and a silencer. The red dot just because I don't really like the iron sights on the foul. Silencer is to keep you off the radar. Uh, the Python, well, it's obviously one of the best pistols. I put the uh, egg hog on it just to be different and uh, be able to kind of snipe people from far away with it. But don't rely on that too much because as soon as you hit that uh, trigger, that ACOG is going to be off the target. Uh, scavenger, because the, the foul doesn't really need scavenger much, but uh, it's helpful. You got Warlord because you obviously need two attachments for the foul unless you want to use the iron side. Uh, and the Marathon just to run. And my other class, which is the one I use the most, is the G11. I switch out the uh, scopes on the G11 depending on what level I'm on. If I know I'm going to be shooting people from far away, I usually use the low powered scope. If I know I'm going to be getting up close, I'm going to, I'm, I take the uh, scope off and just use the iron sights. The CZ75 with wrap with uh, full auto is uh, just for moving down tight hallways in case you run to someone with the automatic because it's if they get the first shot on you and you got the G11, you're not going to win. Uh, I use Ghost Pro even though I don't have a silencer for the G11, but it keeps me off the radar because a lot of people like to spam uh, spy planes. Slide a hand pro so I can get the gun up faster and reload faster. And uh, Ninja Pro. You don't really need Scavenger Pro with the G11 since it holds so much damn ammo. And we got my sniper. I had the variable scope on the L96 and the Macaraw because it's awesome. Someone just joined my party there, but oh well. Uh, Scavenger Pro because it's the L96 doesn't have, have a whole lot of ammo. Scout so you can hold your breath longer. Marathon so you can get from uh, move out of uh, where you snipe somebody last faster. And decoy, throw those out. For some people that like to uh, use the rely on the radar a little too much, throw those out there and uh, might bring them out to the open where you can snipe them. M60, I only use this on one map. I use it on, well, actually two. I sometimes use it on firing range. But yeah, put the grip on it and just uh, have a lot of trigger control. And don't just like hold it down, spray all over the place. But it's good for sniping from far away actually if you just like tap the button. It only takes two shots to kill somebody. Uh, Strella 3 obviously for bringing down anything. Uh, Nova Gas. It's good for clearing out campers if you know someone's held up in a room. Hardline Pro so I can get my kill streaks faster since I usually only use this gun on Nuketown and firing range. Uh, Harden so I can shoot through walls. And the M60 already has a hell of a lot of penetration to begin with, but you put hardened on it, yeah. Hacker, so I don't accidentally trip any uh, claymores and run into stuff I don't want to run into. Now this is my main running class. Use the commando because commando is the best like all around assault rifle. I mean, it's not as accurate as the Fomus. It doesn't have as high as rate as fire as the Fomus. But if you can get the gun up faster than someone with the Fomus does and get the shots off quicker, you'll win. But other than that, the Fomus will sometimes beat the Commando if they if they're if they start firing first. The ballistic knife, because I'm running. If I run out of ammo, I like to rely on that tomahawk. Yeah, it's for showing off. Ghost Pro, obviously, uh, Sleight of Hand Pro, and Marathon Pro. Those are the ones you'll see the most. Here I got the Fomus, which I like to call my noob class. Because I really hate the Fomus. And uh, I put the Master Key on it, because the Fomus will go out of ammo really quick. 
Uh, Makarov because it's one of my favorite pistols. Uh, Ghost Pro, so I am. Uh, I have those on almost everything. Here we got my shotgun class, which is Olympia, because it has the best range and power of all the shotguns. Uh, Pythons, uh, for I got the Kimbo on it, so yeah, I pretty much forced to use hip fire because I'm trying to unlock Steady Aim Pro. And tomahawk, because I'm running. Flashbangs, clear room. Lightweight Pro. Uh, obviously to run faster, steady aim so it tightens the uh, reticles on the shotgun and the python because you're going to be hip firing a lot and marathon pro for running and we'll go over uh, kill streaks real quick right now I got on some low kill streaks because uh, I was playing against a bunch of guys who like to spam spy planes and freaking blackbirds so I got the spy plane on obviously see where they're at uh, counter spot plan to counter their blackbird and rolling thunder just in case I actually get you know a good kill streak going I did with my last game which I'm going to put up probably here on YouTube later uh, I got a, a four multi kill with it and I ended up being like 23 and 3 but uh generally like on uh objective hard objective based gameplay you're gonna want to like have like a napalm strike a sentry gun and a mortar team not of course you can't have sentry gun and a mortar team but pick one of the two have uh probably a spy plane so you can uh really hit those uh objectives if you notice someone's taking it and you have like a mortar team you can obviously bomb the crap out and kill them and stop them from whatever they're doing uh, for Team Deathmatch, you can pretty much use just about anything. A lot of people like to use Blackbird, uh, Attack Dogs, and Chopper Gunner. For obviously, you know, padding their KD. They'll camp until they get the Blackbird, you know, and go crazy with the Chopper Gunner and Attack Dogs. But other than that, uh, that's all I can really think to go over, because that's mostly everything. So, uh, hope you learned something. If you didn't, oh well. Thanks again.